Hello viewers, welcome back to our channel. Today in this video, we will share the top 10 things to do in Barcelona, the cosmopolitan capital of Spain's Catalonia region. Barcelona is a major port and business center. Barcelona has a lot to see and do. It has great art and architecture, rich history from the Middle Ages, and many new, interesting things. The video is going to be very interesting. So watch till end and don't forget to subscribe our channel. Let's get start the video. Number 10. La Sagrada Familia One of God's most famous works in Barcelona, La Sagrada Familia, is a large Roman Catholic church. Since 1882, this huge basilica has been under construction. When it is finally finished in 2026, it will take 144 years to build. God's work was shaped by what he loved in life, including architecture, nature, and religion. He thought about every part of what he made and put it into his buildings. He used crafts like ceramics, stained glass, and wrought ironwork to do this. He also used new ways of working with the materials he used in his work. Gaudi worked on this project for the last 15 years of his life, and he is buried in the building's crypt. Number 9. Barcelona Aquarium The Barcelona Aquarium is one of the largest aquariums in the world with a Mediterranean theme. It is also the most popular and educational marine center in Europe. The aquarium is located in Port Vell, a harbor in Barcelona, and the 35 aquariums at the facility are home to 11,000 animals representing 450 species from different marine systems. You can find amazing sea life anywhere along Spain's coast, from coral reefs to shallow sand beaches. Behind the aquariums is a large team of professionals who use the latest technology to ensure that all sea creatures are healthy and happy. Number 8. The Montjuic Cable Car The Montjuic Cable Car takes people from Barcelona to the top of Montjuic, the city's most historical mountain, with the best views of the Catalan capital. At the parallel metro station, take the funicular and then the cable car for a 750-meter ride to the top of Montjuic, which is high above the city. The Olympic Stadium is a 10-minute walk from the teleferric station, and the Miro Museum is a 5-minute walk away. Both of these places are worth seeing on their own. With brand new cabins that can fit up to 8 people, this is the best way to ride in comfort and see breathtaking views of Barcelona on the way up. Number 7. Casa Badlo Casa Badlo is at number 43 on Paseo de Gracia. This street connected the city to Villa de Gracia, which is now a full part of the city. Casa Badlo is one of the most interesting homes in Europe. God built it at the top of his creative game. The front is covered with blue, mauve, and green tiles, and the window frames and balconies are shaped like waves. The uneven blue-tiled roof has a single tower. Number 6. La Rambla La Rambla is the most famous street in Barcelona. It is a large tree-lined pedestrian boulevard that runs from Plapa Catalunya, where the beautiful Romanesque convent of Santa Ana was built in the 12th century, all the way down to the beach. In the Middle Ages, it marked the edge of the town center in Barcelona's Gothic Quarter. Later, it became a popular street with historic buildings, outdoor cafes, shops, and the well-known La Boqueria food market. The Rambla is different from other streets because it has five streets that flow into each other. Number 5. The Camp Nou The Camp Nou experience is one of Barcelona's most popular tourist spots. It's great to take a tour of the stadium and look at memorabilia from one of the most famous teams in the world. Many well-known people from TV and radio have spent hours here, giving fans at home a sense of the excitement and atmosphere of the game from afar. People can walk around the interactive museum and use touch screens and sound installations to learn about the team. Number 4. Casa Mila. Visitors can look around this UNESCO World Heritage Site, another one of Antoni God's amazing works. The residential building is located in the district and is one of the most famous architectural landmarks, becoming a must-see visitor attraction. The Casa Mila is also known as the Quarry, a reference to its unconventional rough-hewn appearance. The architect made a beautiful building in the modernista style. It has two interior courtyards that give the apartments light and air. 
It was built between 1906 and 1912 and was the last private home designed by Antoni God. Number 3. Barcelona Zoo The Barcelona Zoo is one of the city's most popular places to visit, it is in the Park de la Ciudadela and gets thousands of animal lovers yearly. The Barcelona Zoo is one of the biggest city zoos in the world, with 32 acres of space for more than 2,000 animals from more than 300 species. For a long time, Snowflake was the most famous animal at the zoo. She was the only albino gorilla known to be kept in captivity. People can learn about animals' lives and where they live in the wild. They can also find out about the zoo's conservation and breeding programs. In the Komodo dragon enclosure, you can see the largest lizards in the world. In the aviary, you can look at flocks of parrots and tropical birds. Number 2. Barcelona Beaches The coastline of Barcelona is 4.5 kilometers long, and it has a wide range of great beaches. Ahead of the 1992 Olympics, the town council created an artificial beach from the tip of the Barceloneta to Pablanu. Now, Barcelona has a lot of beautiful beaches that are good for everyone, from those who want to relax to those who want to do extreme sports. La Barceloneta Beach is Barcelona's most busy stretch of sand and water. It is on the coast of a popular neighborhood with the same name. This makes it one of the busiest beaches in Barcelona, but it makes up for many things to do and places to eat seafood. It's a great place to stay if you want to be close to the city's main attractions. Nova Icaria Beach is thought to be the most peaceful in Barcelona. Number 1. Park Gael This colorful park on the hills north of Gracia is where architect Antoni Go tried his hand at landscape gardening. It was meant to be a futuristic housing complex at first. This amazing, striking and enchanting place is where his passion for natural forms took flight and visitors can see exuberant buildings, colorful tile work, and the amazing snaking serpent bench. The park is extremely popular, and access to the central area is limited to a certain number of people every half hour, so visitors are advised to book ahead. This is end of the video. Let us know in the comment box which thing you wish to do in Barcelona. Like and share our video with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. See you all in the next video.